I started off with ICICI One Source before I joined Tesco, and uh, I had no idea about Tesco when I joined it. Uh, I just followed Meena Ganesh because she used to be the uh, CEO, CEO of uh, ICICI One Source. And um, when I joined here, it wasn't really a big brand, uh, so I felt it was a bit of a risky decision. But uh, absolutely no regrets. It's been the best decision of my life. Um, it's been great because when I joined, I was the 27th employee, and I know we are 6,000 something today. Uh, so clearly, uh, you know, I made the right decision, and uh, that feels like in itself a big achievement. Uh, for me personally, my biggest, the most defining uh, moment in my career has been the first opportunity to travel. Um, it was back in 2005 and um, I, that really changed my job, my profile um, and, and a lot of other things for me personally as well. Uh, my family has been very, very important to uh, my, and every change in, in whatever I did in uh, my career. Uh, initially, it was my parents, then my wife. Uh, I used to always bounce off ideas with them uh, to make sure that you know there is some sort of a sanity check in whatever I was doing and uh, that's really the key role that they've played. For those thinking of a long-term career in Tesco HSC, my personal advice would be to, uh, to venture and, and understand what's there all across Tesco. I've been in four different departments and I think that's been my greatest achievement uh, in, in terms of my career. And I would truly suggest that people do the same thing, you know, go across departments and understand what's happening, work in different roles, and you'll truly be able to appreciate the organization for what it is. I believe the next 10 years is going to be around uh, simplifying, uh, making things better for Tesco, and, and, and really just stabilizing the existing processes. What made me stay for the past 10 years is really the change that I've had. Uh, like I said, I've, been, I've worked in four different business areas. Uh, I've worked five to six different roles. Um, so every time I differ did a different role in a different business area, it was like working in a different company. So I guess that's what kept me ticking. I've known uh, Ash for nearly seven years. I worked with him briefly in 2009-10 on uh, the group procurement transition. Uh, but more extensively in the last one year when he joined uh, Group Commercial Finance. He's been directly working with me in the last six months and it's been an absolute delight to have him in the team. Ash is a health freak. You'll always find him with a bottle of water, uh, whether he's having lunch or in a meeting or even if he's doing his one-on-one, -on -one, you'll always find him with a bottle of water. And meet him in the evening, you're bound to find him biting into an apple. I would describe um, Ash as a very structured, a very meticulous person, detailed, thorough in his work. Uh, he gels easily with people, is uh, well respected uh, and I must say he's a veteran at, at transitions. Uh, I'd also say he's very logical um, and reasonable in his approach. Uh, of course there's a joke in our team that Ash is like the Benjamin Button of GCF. He's uh, growing younger and younger by the day. Uh, in fact we play this game Guess Ash's Age, it's our favourite game in the team. Ash is very articulate and confident, which um, clearly comes across in his interactions, particularly with uh, the stakeholders. Uh, his clarity of thought and sense of ownership are definitely something that sets him apart from the rest. He listens and listens really well. He has a right balance and is a complete package. Uh, in terms of the leadership skills, I would say collaboration, empathy are his strengths. Uh, he leverages his experience and relationships well in any role he performs. Ashish, many congratulations on completing 10 years in Tesco um, and I wish you a lot many more decades to come. I've known you from 2007, um, I guess when we started to work together on the commercial project and uh, there are a lot of things that people need to know about you. Uh, one is your ever enduring smile. Uh, you never seem to amaze me with um, how much you can actually kind of smile at, at things. And um, the, the one which uh, I remember very well is when we were working on creating the project management handbook. Um, the amount of uh, work that you put in, um, I actually had a comment. You, you cleaned it up so well that uh, we could actually eat out on the floor. Um, so Ashish, uh, you've been uh, an amazing person to work with. Um, just been absolutely wonderful as a colleague, as a friend. Uh, you never uh, you know, kind of cease to take on challenges and opportunities. And um, all the very best. I think um, you, you are one of those few uh, that have stayed on in Tesco for the last 10 years. And uh, I just want to make sure that you've uh, succeeded in whatever ambitions and achievements you wanted to have in the first place. Uh, wish you all the very best. <laughs>